Here's a classic Ray Burger design called the Dogwood, and specifically it's called the Large Dogwood. And uh, this particular piece is likely from the 80s, maybe early 90s. And uh, I can tell because uh, it has aspects that were unique to that uh, era, uh, like the butterflies and uh, how the brass has been melted along the edges. Um, these are copper butterflies and the little figures in between there. And, and uh, each of these leaves look to be uh, uh, burned on the edges uh, by hand and veined each one by hand and darkened. Uh, this, the copper trunk is made of um, flat copper stock that's been annealed and tapered and shaped. And then once it's shaped into a tube, uh, you have to go and take a bandsaw and cut slices into it so that you can bend it. It's a very time consuming process. A lot of work goes into this piece. Um, this isn't uh, this uh, this isn't just copper tubing from a hardware store. Uh, everything that you see here is done by hand. Uh, the little antennae, the, the, the brass drops that have been hammered, the blossoms uh, are brass and tipped each by hand. The blossoms are then ground with a, a hand grinder to create that effect. Uh, this is a classic and uh, uh, timeless piece that actually I think hung in my father's house uh, up until the time of his death. So um, the super dogwood or the large dogwood tree from Ray Burger.